Well, the John Smith's handicap hurdle next, and if we can get our breath back after that thrilling Grand National. Three miles and one furlong, 0 to 160 this one, and we've got Lint at the top for Darren Thompson, along with Leaf River for the same train. I watched this order and Blood Eagle for Leon Van Rensburg last week. Last week's Gold Cup with a Blackburn of Steel coming out in the handicap after the Grand National for David Robertson, Velvet Top for Graham Clutterbuck, Manic Monday for Badrang Hogan, Hard Glass Judith for David Robertson, Met to Combat, the winner of last week's Kim Muir for Martin Little, Maguro Blade, Padraig Hogan, Magical Times, David Hooley, Magic Spell, and just Rosie Craig Beck with Quake, Paul Rhodes, Crackled Alex Cherry, Thick as Thieves, Kevin Meenan, Broken Glass, Graham Clutterbuck, the Zartina Actress, Alex Cherry and Harry's your man and Alexander Minx for Stu Grace are the same number of runners as we had in the National then and if we get half as good a race we'll all be happy and away they go and I'll make a request to the race planners can we have the Grand National as my last race of commentating next season please because I'm absolutely worn out after that they're all safe over the first and it's the Alex Cherry pair who've gone off into the lead so Zartina Actress and Crackled are one and two from Quake on the inside third. The rest of them really tightly bunched as they get to the second of the 17th. And they're all safely over that one with Zartina Actress in front. From Mech the Combat who's come through now into second. With Harry's your man also close up there as they come past the Big screen to take the fence, it'll be the last in a couple of circuits time with a leader really stood off that but got away with it and continues to lead from the Stu Grey pair. Well, second and third, Harry's your man and Alexander Mix. Then Mech the Combat on the wide outside giving away a lot of ground today. He is fourth, then Quake and Crackled and then Lintz and then Leaf River and Broken Glass. In towards the back hard glass, Judith the Grey is out the back with Magic Spell, Velvet Tops also nearer the back than the front. But it's Zartina Actress who's got the lead and leads by about a length through. Harry's your man in second, Gap, then off two lengths or so to the next pair who ironically are um, Alex Cherry and Stu Grey again with Crackled and Alexander Minx, then comes Leaf River and then Quake, then Lintz, then Watch Disorder and Thick and Thieves and Broken Glass and then the last week's Gold Cup winner, last week's surprise Gold Cup winner, Blackburn Steel for David Robertson, the man of the moment and it's Zartina Actress who gets over the fourth in the lead. They're all safely over that, Mech to Combat has dropped right to the back now, has run a little bit wide, good winner of the Kim Muir last week but doesn't look as though He's enjoying this today with the rain coming down as they get to the fifth. And they all sail over the fifth, all jump that really well. And looks like we're going to get a lot more round this time than we got in the national as they get to the sixth. And there's a crashing fall there for Mech to Combat. I said he didn't look like he was enjoying it. And last year, last week's good winner has crashed out at that one. It was a nasty looking fall as well. So Zartina Actress is in the lead. Coming into the next from Harry's your man in second. Then Alexander Minx and Leaf River and then crack what I watch this order and Blackburn Steel is after that one and then Broken Glass, Maguro Blade and Hard Glass Judith for mid division. Quakes lost its place. And Thick as Thieves is towards about Blood Eagle hasn't got going at all today so far. And Magical Times is now the back marker with Velvet Top. But Zartina Actress and Harry's your man will pop over the eighth in the lead. The rest of them getting over it okay. Just lost the one so far in Mech to Combat, but it's Zartina Actress who leads by a length to Harry's your man in second. Then comes Alexander Mix and Watch Disorder, and then Leaf River and Crackled and Broken Glass and Lintz and Blackburn Steel, the Gold Cup winner, getting ever closer as well as they skip over that next one. And they've still got a mile and a half to go as they race up the straight and past the stand. And they'll take the fence just after this screen, which will be the last next time. And they're all safely over that one with Zartina Actress the leader. Harry's your man is second, and then Alexander Minx is third. Leaf River is four, and Watch this order is five. Crackle is six. And then Magic Spell and Broken Glass and then Hard Glass Judith and Quake and Lintz and Thickest Thieves and Blackburn Steel and Maguro Blade and then Manic Monday and Magical Times and Velvet Top Blood Eagles after that one and Just Rosie is now the back marker. But it's Zartina Actress and Harry's your man one and two. Alexander Minx sitting quietly behind him in third. Then Leaf River and Crackle to watch this order and Hard Glass Judith and then Broken Glass and Quake as they race on down towards the next fence then with Zartina Actress on the inside travelling nicely from Harry's your man and Alexander Minx then comes Watch Disorder who's getting that little bit closer 
And on the outside of that one, Quake has come back into it as well. It's still wide open, this one. And they're inside the final mile now. And Zartina actress landed in the lead from Harry's your man. Quake made a mistake on the outside. Alexander Minx going well on the inside. Crackled is still there. Now Blood Eagle is starting to make a forward move around the outside. And Blackburn Steel is getting closer as well as they get over the 12th. They're all over the 12th. OK, Velvet top the one. Struggling out the back. Manic Monday and Magical Times have got work to do. They're coming down towards the 13th. And at the 13th, it's now Harry's your man who's just about taking it up from Leaf River. Zartina Actress is still there though on the inside. Quake and watch this order. Maguro Blade is now coming through. Here comes Blackburn Steel. Then comes Blood Eagle. Crackled Magic Spells trying to get into it. Just Rosie around the outside. Over to 14th they go and it's just Leaf River. River in front. Leaf River's just in the lead of Quake and Zartina Actress. They race down towards the third from home. Here comes the grey Art Glass Judith for David Robertson. He come through to take it up again. And it's Art Glass Judith who's come through to take the lead then. Art Glass Judith coming down towards the third last. Put his head in front. Comes up to it now. Pops over in front. Jumps it better. Quake's over it in second. Then Leaf River. Zartina Actress is now dropping away. Watch this order. He's trying to run on. But it's Quake and Art Glass Judith racing down towards the final two fences then with Leaf River on their inside. These three are clear of watch disorder over the last attack and last they go. And it's just Quake in front. Quake's just in the lead, but it's three of them. Virtually inseparable, their heads are bobbing. The jockeys are giving in everything. They're racing down towards the final fence. It'll surely come down to the jump. It's Leaf River on the inside. It's Art Class Judith on the near side. Quake between the two of them. They come to it. Quake takes it up. Quake jumps it slowly, though. Quake's over in the lead. There was a crashing fall there for a couple of them at the back. But it's Quake who's gone on. And Quake is now racing away to take it. Quake wins it. Fast finishing. Maguro Blade was close up. Hard oh, class Judith was still there as well. Manic Monday and Harry's your man. And just Rosie went at the last. And Quake has taken it for Paul Rhodes. It's close for second. Just Leaf River. Maguro Blade was finishing fast. But it's Quake the winner for Paul Rhodes. Leaf River Darren Thompson second. Maguro Blade Padre Hogan third. And David Robertson fourth and fifth with R-Class Judith and the Gold Cup winner, Blackburn Steel.